Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Ward's adventure in Factorio here. And so what's going on? What's going on? Well, we were trying to figure this all out here and I kind of screwed up because I put these up here above, but they're still going to work out. So to prove that, let's carry on with what we were doing. So what were we doing? We were processing materials here, processing some fuel, and we were you know, going to fill these up for for smelting purposes. So to do that, we need fuel, and we need two more of these guys. We need iron. It looks like. Let's see how much iron is collected? A bunch. Okay, perfect. How about some of this stuff here? We need some more copper. Let's dump that in there. Perfect. Okay. Okay, so this fuel is going to come straight down. It's going to branch off. It's going to go this way for the copper. Ah, that's a small copper deposit, hey? So we have the other copper deposit over here to the right that we'll harvest. And we'll bring in probably over here and kind of smelt it over in this area maybe. Yeah, maybe. So let's do some research here. So we did the military research. So now let's do armor crafting since that's next okay so let's carry on with this project here so let us build uh, two more of these guys okay so that will do this and this and then we want to dump these like this and like this fortunately we have to put more power poles because that's just the way it goes Okay, we got the power poles there. Now we need to place belts. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So we need more iron. Alt just to see what this stuff is. Okay, perfect. Let's see here. Let's check on the fuel actually. So let's pick up a bunch of coal here. Let's just stand right here and suck it up. Perfect. I'm not sure how long this episode's going to be, so grab some tasty treats, and grab a drink, and you sit down and get ready to play with with Charlemagne here. <laughs> yeah, we got a bunch of that. Okay, so well, almost too much, but that's okay. So we want to throw a bunch more into here. Some more copper. Let's run down here. Looks like the research is done. So the research is going way fast, which is nice. Shotgun shell. Bullet shooting speed. Maybe we'll increase that. Because that's still only red. <laughs> Let's do steel processing. Because, yeah, steel chest. Let's do stone walls. Because we'll need that next. We do have turrets. So can we make turrets? Let's see here. How do we need for turrets? We need iron and copper. And iron plates. So we need more plate processing. So that's priority. So let's go drop off our our coal here. Control the left click does all of it. I'm just kind of taking a couple stacks. Well not a couple stacks, but stacking a bit. This is cool how this research builds up. That's nice. Let's grab some steel plates. Let's hook this up here. So that means we want to do that, and then we want to do that. Then we want to go underneath. Let's just connect it in with this stuff, maybe. That should be okay because it sh it shouldn't ever clog up. So this one, it's gonna go straight down this way. Ah, we need more. <laughs> so now with this happening here, maybe this will process a bit faster? I don't know. Let's see here. Let's take that. Grab that. Dump that all in there. Make sure we top up. Okay, let's kind of double. So this stuff's all working as expected, which is nice. 
up here we have this guy this guy has 240 left in there I think we can just leave what's left in there we got all the stone we can use which is nice uh, these guys are using up coal which is good oh, stone walls are done so what's next here smart inserters so let's do yeah let's definitely do electronics I guess maybe yeah let's do electronics because we need to do your green research eventually so let's do all the red research caps let's see here why is this not uh, it's because it's probably waiting for that so to fix that let's put an iron chest here let's build one of these guys okay let's put that like that okay there we go and let's not restrict that we'll just keep that going let's see what happens here okay well as long as they keep inserting into here that'd be okay so let's just kind of watch for that Or is it the other guy taking it? See, the prioritization is kind of goofy. So, to fix that, let's do this, let's do that. Okay, let's put this chest right here. And what we're going to do is we'll put this like this and this like that. So, what's going to happen is this is our buffer chest and this okay yeah perfect this will take from that and we need to place power here perfect now watch so basically this will process and put it into here and then we'll put it into this but this guy when it needs it and I think that is perfect okay good 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 so that will continue then here our steel plates will continue to be processed and we need to work on this other side here so let's get this side hooked up. What? Don't I not have any? Okay, let's right click to make a bunch of these guys. We need to make a couple of these guys, maybe a couple splitters. We need more iron. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we need to make a couple turrets. One, two, three. Why not? We need more bullets. So regular magazines just need that. Okay, so let's make an assembly machine, which means we need more, I guess, iron for that. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. Okay, good. Those are, are filling up. Excellent. Shoot, those aliens there are going to be disturbed. That sucks. But uh, this should be almost done, so that's good, that's good. We need to build some ammo, so what do we need for assembly machine? We're going to need more iron. Let's see if that's enough. No, it's still not enough. Oh, almost there. <laughs> there we go, we build an assembly machine. Then we can place this guy as soon as it's built. So this is going to build ammo. We're just going to take it directly off the the belt. Uh, we need more iron, I guess. Yeah, there we go. Let's track, take it off the belt. Make just regular ammo for now, I guess. Let's dump some of those in there. Let's see what happens here. This should go up to a stack of, of 50, I hope, but let's see here. Ah, it is taking it. Okay, good. So we need to hook this guy up then. So we need to take this out, this one, and this one. We need to make underground belt. 
And let's bring this guy down. Connect that in, and that sh sh should be okay. We got more processing now with both sides, so that's okay. Let's see here. Now we can kind of do a balancing here, sort of. Kind of do this and do it like that. Now that will balance it a little bit, I guess. Let's dump this stuff. Um, just put this stuff directly in there. Perfect. Okay. So, so this is going really good. The copper stuff I want to kind of take from over here, but let's set up. I think we might need to have a thing offloading this. It's not taking plates anymore. So we need another thing. So more plates. Okay. Oh, lots of plates there. Perfect. Okay. And let's empty that into a box. Another iron chest, of course. There we go. Now that. Let's cap this at just a couple hundred. I think that would be enough. And we need to place a couple of these turrets down here. They changed the look of the turrets now, which is kind of cool. So let's put one here. Let's put one here and kind of one down here. Okay, and let's go one. Um, how do you do this? Control? No. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Let's just kind of manually put it in, uh, in there. One, two, three, four, five. We'll of course have to put more ammo into these gun turrets just in case if they come attacking. Yeah, at least one, a little bit of ammo here. And actually, we should be able to make ourselves some armor. Yeah, we can make some iron armor. Let's make that. So we have that. Let's grab those so that we have more ammo. Perfect. We're going to have to make a machine gun. So, how do we make that? We need more iron plates. Let's make a machine gun so that way we have more stuff. There we go. And let's make sure to grab the ammo. Perfect. So the ammo is producing nicely. That's just what I like to see. Plates coming down. So it's copper is what's kind of happening. So let's see here. Let's throw this in there. Perfect. Okay. We got stone there to process eventually. Uh, we got research that's flashing at us. Let's see what's the next item we can kind of do that's red. We can do automation two. Uh, let's see, we can do optics. Let's do optics for the lights. Perfect. Grab some more bullets. Um, oh, we should check on the the fuel. Uh, so let's bring this fuel, continue to bring this fuel down. Let's see, go like this. We're going to bring this stuff, I think, down into this way. Um, we need to build more of these. Let's build all of them. Basically, need more plates. Oh, I guess we could take some of these gears. We can take all the gears. <laughs> Man. Okay. Okay, it never fails. Again, I get interrupted by my family. So, here we go again. Uh, we're bringing down this coal supply. So, let's carry on with that. How are we going to do that? Well, let's bring it in this way. Let's chop this down. Let's move the wires. Let's see here. If we take that one. There, how about that? Okay, perfect.
Let's kind of chop all the trees on our way. Okay, so let's bring this guy down. Now there's music. Oh. There we go. And bring it. Ah! We're almost there. So, what we're going to do is we're going to bring these across into here. And then this, I think we'll. We can do that. Let's put the rest of it on there except for a stack. I need to build one of these guys. Watch, watch, watch. Oh yes, bang, now optics is finished, so what else can we do that's red? Let's do steel processing since that's only 20, and there we go, off we go. So now we have coal being stored, which is going to be used towards the fuel, just the one side of it here, that's all we really need to utilize, and this is all the storage now basically, and slowly it's going to go into, yeah. It's exciting, it's exciting, okay. So, let's kind of continue processing this stuff. I don't think we need to do it by hand anymore, so let's do this. Let's do that, we need another arm. Arm, well, well you know what I mean, another one of these inserters here. Okay, we need to do that we need to offload these onto there and then we need to add power oops that's the wrong spot okay then we need to add another box another inserter and we'll just have to keep this going type of thing yeah okay perfect i think that's how we'll do it and then we'll just make sure we keep putting fuel in here to keep it going, but that should keep processing for us. Now we need to decide how we're going to make the green stuff. So how do we make green research? We need inserters and transport belts. So transport belts are used by iron. Transport belts are used by iron. So iron and gears, right? Right here we see them. Let's pick up ammo. We need a bunch of ammo. Okay. Let's top up all this stuff here. Uh, let's see. Let's, let's make sure there's 30 units in each stuff. 28 times 30. Okay, perfect. We don't need the pistol anymore. That's pretty much garbage which is good so we never really got to use it <laughs> kind of like the starter gun if that makes sense let's see here okay perfect 30 so I think they all have 30 this I think is done now perfect we got all the stone that we can utilize so with that in mind I know we need to make another mining drill for the stone here Pollution might actually decrease a bit. Okay. Green research. How are we going to get green research onto this? We need one of these guys. We need green research. We need inserters. And so, inserters, we need electronic circuits. Iron and copper plates. So, see, so we're starting to mix in the materials. Iron, so we need to think about getting copper, so I'm going to try and take out those 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 aliens up there. Oh, I don't know if I like that idea, but let's see here. Let's actually use turrets for that. Where are we? We need more stone wall, we need stone bricks. So that means we would need a furnace. Uh, let's see, let's create a stone furnace. Ok, 
Okay, we need one of these and we need more, of course, steel. Bang, okay. And let's see here. And then we need also stone bricks. I think that's, oh no, yeah, that's right. Another one of these and an iron chest. Perfect. And what we'll do is we'll simply do this with into one of these guys which will have full and then and then it will deposit into a box and then we can hook this up with power one two just like that and voila off we go processing this all this stone here into this stuff. Man, dogs are barking here. I apologize if you can hear them. If not, hey, great. So let's see here. So these are better, let's see, furnaces. Let's see here. Man, third time around. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, so what are we gonna do next for research? Needs to be only red, so uh, I think we're running out of options. So let's do bullet damage, since that's what we have. Okay, let's kind of go down over here. Let's grab this. Okay, machine guns, beautiful. And we got processing here. You need to think about this copper over here. Let's see, let's grab a couple miners. Let's kind of go over here. Yeah, we'll probably bring the copper over. So it looks like a pretty big deposit here, actually. Quite nice, quite nice. Let's cut some trees down here and get the area ready. And I think what's going to happen is we're going to take this over in the next episode and bring it into our base there and I don't know maybe we'll build the bus in the middle well bus or whatever I don't know we're gonna basically bring in all the materials in through belts and then we're gonna build a base somewhere along the lines I'm not sure which way which direction or how but it might be just a big jumbled mess I don't know maybe this one will be smaller and then the next one will be bigger maybe we'll be able to use the map a little bit better I don't know. I don't know. There's lots of possibilities with this game, right? So that's what's cool about this game is just there's there's so much to do. Here we go. Okay, so this must be the edge. There's so much to do. There's so many different ways to do it. It's just ah, it's just amazing. So let's put this like this. Let's see here is chop some of these these guys down. Just kind of see where the edge of this deposit lies. Okay. Okay, so kind of zigzags up a bit. That's okay. And then what we can do is one side. Just like that, so both sides will be used. Okay, let's just kind of cut the trees down in this direction here for the copper. We're going to have to put a turret down over here. Man, so much work to do, so little time. So it looks like the pollution has decreased a little bit, but it might have increased because of the the stone processing. So let's see here. Let's let's see. It's how far do we want to bring in the copper? I'm thinking all the way this way. Let's see here. I'm thinking a route about into here will bring in the copper, and then we'll figure out what to do with it in here. 
maybe along the same lines in here, bring this coal over and then down and around back into here or something. I don't know. Or maybe just split it and then have a second line go here to feed the, the copper. So as you can tell, it's favoring the one side all the way down. I guess we could create a balancer that would help alleviate the pressure. So let us do that. So let us, let's see here, how do we do this? I think it's like this. I don't know, man. I, I, there's a certain way that the balancer goes, and I think, let me build some more of these guys. I'll figure it out here in a second here. So I think it goes something like this. Then we have th this guy. I think... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think this is it. I think like this. So, that means if we take this exact copy, do this, and then we go like this, like this. Bang, 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 like that. There we go. That should bounce it, I think. Looks like it. There's one piece of coal there. There we go. There we go. That should fix it. Now both sides will be filled up again. So that's exactly what I was thinking of for the balancer type of dealie. And now you can see it's slowly being used up nicely. So, perfect. And let's see here. Once that fills up, that'll be nice. There we go. Beautiful. Yeah, and then see it fills up the one side, and then it, it keeps pushing it to the other side. See? And then it fills up, and then it clogs up, and then it slowly backs up. Beautiful. Okay. So yeah, so there you go, everybody. So we got the the, the coal plugged into our system, our main system here. Let's see about the wood here. Let's kind of grab some of this, some of that. Got a lot of wood actually to throw onto the system. There you go, because we do want to use the wood up. This is how we use it up. Right, so this is kind of like a buffer system for fuel, and looks like performance-wise, we still have plenty. Three, four, five. So maybe we can make a second column. Let's see here. Let's kind of chop some trees down. Okay, maybe we can make a second column. So let's build some pipes here. We might have to kind of change the wires here a bit. There we go. Okay, and now let's bring out two, three. I think second column will go like this. So let's see here, steam engines. Let's build another one just to kind of get the idea. Actually, just like that, that would be even better. So that way they're both hooked up. Perfect, okay. Now we just have to kind of watch this stuff because this can push out a lot of water and this should be enough for our purposes here in this place, in this foreign, foreign place. Um, do we not have any research happening? Oh because we don't have any pla iron plates. Maybe we should hook the plates up too. Why not, eh? Let's do that. 
I don't know if it's permanent. I think this is going to be more of a temporary thing, but... Oops. Oh, well, one more belt. <laughs> oh, man. That's so funny. I uh, mean, one of these guys. Like that. Like that. And that should be the plates that we need. Perfect. Let's make sure we got fuel in here. Perfect. Now what are we going to do with this pistol here? Hmm. Maybe we should make a regular chest. Yeah, let's make a chest. An iron chest. And that's just for storage, right? So let's put it right here. Maybe because what we'll do is the main part of the base maybe will stretch out in this direction. What's this? Stone here, hey? Let's place this here. Create one of those. Let's mine out that stone. There's more stone here. So basically this area here will be kind of where our base will stretch from, I think. So for now though, we'll just kind of create all this, do it all this way, and go from there. Uh, let's see, let's let's stock up on bullets here, and then we'll say goodbye. Uh, let's make sure that we're topped up with bullets. Perfect, and we can make some more turrets. Look at that, look at that. Almost topped up with bullets. Good, good, good. Perfect. Now let us, we're going to need to make more turrets. Let's make a radar unit because we haven't built one of those. And let's build a couple turrets. I do want to get some steel processing happening. So let's build one of those. Maybe we'll just take the steel directly off of here. Hmm, maybe, maybe. How much more bullets? So we got 100 there, 12 there. What I want to do is put a turret out over here. This guy right here. Because when they do become active, then they definitely will be shooting. <laughs> So we want that to be doing it, uh, doing its best. Okay, that's to signify we're going to go down from there. Perfect. How are these doing for resources? Okay, how are we doing here for steel? Bullets. How about fuel? Let's scoop up some of this fuel here. And let us double check up here. Uh, I think we had this thing going, yeah, okay. How many bricks do we have? Beautiful. Oh, so here's one of the new features I want to show you. So these are the bricks, right? Well, if we put it in our hotbar, and say we... I don't know where I want to put these bricks, but we'll just, we'll just place it down here, around here, just to show you what I mean. So see, we have this little area here, and you can kind of see an area beneath them, right? So let's kind of do underneath the lab. See we can actually change the train now and here and you can actually go a little bit faster on here. So yeah um, we can't change the size of these things so basically it's always the block of four and if you look these are all bricks. See now I can run a little bit faster on those. See that is so exciting. Woot woot! Yeah cool. So that's one of the new features is these bricks here see what they look like. There's also concrete we can make which will make better version of the bricks. So let's place this radar right here, right in the middle. That way you can start mapping out the area and show us where everything is here and maybe do our plan of attack. We'll have to kind of start wiping out these bases here so we can kind of clear out some area and go from there. So yes, yeah, so thank everybody for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this episode, and I look forward to seeing you in the next episode. So, yes, bye-bye. <laughs>